Hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Garrett, and welcome back to Far Cry 6 on the PlayStation 5. So, I stepped away from this game after beating it because I just didn't care. But I ended up having the season pass for it, so I thought I might as well try to play through these. Um, now that all three of them are out, it's been a while. So, we'll start off on Vast for Insanity. Uh, single player. At a center, a priestess named Citra. Jason became her warrior, sent her to kill his. sent to kill her greatest mistake, her brother. Her failure. Her monster. Caught in a cycle of blood and insanity. See, I loved Far Cry 3. I really enjoyed Far Cry 3. What the fuck? The ending was the worst part of the game. What is going on? It just fell so flat compared to the rest of the game. It's been well Where over a year since I, I played the Far Cry 6. Is this? I was just looking at my shelf trying to find things to play Such between uh, God of War and gather the pieces of my blade. Dead Bring Space, because I'm waiting for my sp Dead Space copy to arrive. Oh, I know you want my approval. My love, my body, my smell, my legs. No, 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 no. Get the fuck out of my head. <laughs> Wild as ever. But if you want to escape your mind, you'll do as I say. Right okay. now, you are weak. Look in the mirror. Permanent traits. That's cool. Okay. If now, take something for the pain. Good. But to survive your mind, you're going to need some weapons. So from what it looks like, it seems to be kind of like a, uh, what do you call it? A, uh, kind of trial-based game for this one, at least. Cool puppy likes this. If you want more guns, you'll have to earn them. <laughs> Okay, Vaz. All right, just gotta find the fucking knife. But if I'm gonna be digging in my mind, you might want to close your eyes, Citra. Okay, collect three pieces of the silver dragon blade. Discover unique location challenges that will reward you with cash and weapons, other helpful items. Okay, so if we die, we just lose our items. Good to know. Should I be worried right now? Quite a capable map. So this is a safe zone.
cash, collect cash to buy taking out enemies, opening chests and completing challenges. Spend cash to get stuff. Oh, this is like money, and I can use this money to kick some ass. Okay? Kinda like a politician. <laughs> you see this shit? Giant red door with a fucking eyeball on it. <laughs> now, I know how this works. This is gonna matter later, right? Cool, a wall of text. How exciting. <laughs> Thank you, boss. <laughs> Can I? Oh. Okay. Those sharks are up in the sky. I doubt this is enough to buy anything now. So, do we have an idea? Are they in this area? Are they outside this area? Maybe. Let's go outside the area. See what happens. Oh. Hey, Voss. <laughs> ah, Jason, the distracting sound of rot inside my mind. I'm gonna enjoy doing it. Come on, Citra told me if I make your life a living hell, she'll give me anything I want. Anything. Okay. <laughs> You understand. I mean, it's how she controls you, right? Oh, I'm gonna see you soon, and I'll let you know how I feel. Hey, wait a minute. These are my fucking people. Why are they coming after me? Because I told them to. You left us. You fought us, and now they want you dead. You know, unfortunately, anybody who... Armory challenges. Complete challenges to unlock new weapons. And Oh, yeah. Okay. Cool enough. You are so Low difficulty. Claim more power. That gets me out of here. Sure. And then approach the altar. Face those you have wronged. Dance around a bit. Come on. Look, I only got a pistol. You guys got to get a little closer here. Hold on, I want to see. I got, I got to take off this adaptive trigger BS. Got you. Took off the adaptive trigger and I can already feel a difference. I only have a few bullets left. Want to die? I gotta get something big. I gotta get somewhere and get cover.
Come on. Did I win? I only shot okay, it. I won. Dead. Can I get my new gun? Do I get my toy? <laughs> I love his voice actor. It was so good from the game, and to have him come back and do it more is just great. I remember all, I was I worked at GameStop during that time period. Oh, thank you, Ubisoft Connect. And I remember the marketing material behind this game was so good. And it was funny because as working at GameStop, you, you had tons. It, it was a game that didn't, nobody expected to do well. Like, nobody was excited about it. Nobody cared about it. And then when it came out, it rocked. And everyone's like, holy crap, this is a great game. And I remember people coming in looking for copies. We'd have, we'd be without copies. I mean, we'd get some in and instantly be sold within hours. Sometimes. What's this problem? And uh, yeah, I just remember that happening. Like we get in five copies and they would be sold that day for weeks. Oh. Money for killing. You sick fucks. Yes, when you kill, die, take from those weaker than you, you will get stronger. So if you want out of here, don't stop. Okay. I still remember a time period that I had a kid with his mom come up and he had a copy of the game in his hands. I don't remember how soon it was from launch, but he's like. Yeah, I want to buy this game, and of course, that was one of the perks that so many people never talk about, was shitting on kids for getting M-rated titles when their parents didn't know what they were M-rated. It was so much fun, because you'd just go, you know, hey, Mr. or Mrs., you know, I just want to let you know on this game, it's kind of part of my job, that uh, this game is rated M for Mature. Uh, there is, you know, not only just shooting and violence like that in the game but there's sex scenes in the game and i mean pretty pretty graphic stuff like that and that usually you know shooting was never really the big problem it was always the uh, sex scenes and i i still remember that parent was like really like yeah i mean it's all, i was like i showed him on the back of the game you know showing the the m-rated logo on there and i was like yeah and she's like, well, thank you so much for telling me that. And the kid just looked at me and was so mad. He's like, he, I, I ruined his day. You could tell. So good. What we might do is after I grab what's ever up here is go back and upgrade. We are taking some hits. Cause I don't know, how, you know, you, you don't, I don't floating rocks are screwing with me. You don't know how deep in here we have to be to get some new weapons on. Oh, well you need the upgrade shit. A single a single pistol here, not my weapon of choice. What?
Yep, I'm dead. So how how difficult? I mean, are we 100% back to where we were? Oh, we are. Aren't we? Oh no, 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 no. We we can now have a bow. No, we can't, but we unlock the ability to buy the bow. But all of our money kaput. Okay, so fucking cross and let me be reborn. I did not that in mind we will be more careful. Power, weapons, and most of all most of your cash. We get to keep traits. Weapon cases, weapon upgrades, and power bar sockets. Okay. That can be a good thing. Every end has a beginning. I like that. So, does that mean chests? Yep, they are all resealed as well. Boom. Alright, so we have to be more careful. Like, I know that it told us, like, hey, ha, 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 you're going to need, you know, keep your stuff. You know, you're going to die if you, you lose everything, you're going to die. Took must be some next level shit. I cannot fucking remember a thing. What? Okay. So that means that this little chest, is this a new challenge? Yeah, so we've already done that challenge. Since we uh, unlocked the bow, so we don't need to redo that one. He's hiding like a what is that? I think our dead friend dropped something. Okay. Well, I mean, I, I'm enjoying this combat mode somewhat. Now, it's more like a roguelite, I guess, than a trials-based game. Which, normally I hate roguelites, so... I think Voss here will keep me entertained enough. Try to gather up some things here. Oh, that's another trial. How hard is this one? Does it tell me? Auto pistol, huh? Okay, if I kill more people, you're gonna give me a new gun. Probably level right? three. Auto pistol be great. <laughs> Thanks for shooting that, hitting that dog for me. Wow. Heal, hurry. Uh. 
try to sneak here. Heal, hurry! Okay. Take a breather. One more. So we have to clip. Oh, if we come up here, we get to, we get to collect the weapon, huh? No. Okay, that's what I did last time. Yeah, gun control. Oh yeah. What's the power? Yeah, take it. So we've unlocked the pistol. Power is a passive buff. Yep, which we just picked up. Can be found in chest drop by defeated enemies or purchased the armory. Power can be equipped or sold for cash. Good to know. What's this one? Grayling improves movement, noise, impairs general. Uh, no, sell that. General defense drops, but I get to be a little bit easier for movement. Nah, I don't care about that. What we got here. Oh, more stuff. Okay, well, I think that's a good start to this mission here. We're going to pause it, continue it in the next episode, and yeah, just start collecting up these dragon blades. So, thank you all for watching. Really do appreciate it. If you can. Give the video a like, it does help me out quite a bit. Also, check out the channel because I have tons of videos going on over there. And until next time, you guys, stay frosty.